All right, moment of truth. Okay, first, oh, why don't we do them both at the same time? Three, two, one. Hey, that's beautiful. Right here we have the fan, uh, the new fan that we got. So first, we're going to install the mounting bracket. Like I said before, make sure that the breaker's off so you don't get shocked by this. When you put this up, there should be enough space in between the bracket and the assembly that the wires can fit in between. Putting on these screws for us personally is probably the hardest part of installing this fan. And then we sort of finagle it way through so you can see both chains coming out of different holes. Oh, there we go. So that's what it looks like. And now we're going to turn the power on and see if all of our work is for not is not for not. All right, so we tested the fan worked, but the lights did not. So we took apart everything, uh, or rather, my dad took apart everything, and we tested the motor. As you can see, it's live. We tested the light. Nothing. So if we go to the switch, so we're at the switch right now, and if we put it's currently at the off state. So if we put the checker on the right side. You can see that it beeps, and if you put it on the left side, there's nothing. And that's supposed to happen because what a switch does is it opens and closes the circuit. So when it's on, on this side, it should beep. But as you see, it won't. So let's go to my room and see if it works on here. I apologize, it's a bit messy, and hopefully I covered up that mess before we <laughs> look at it. But right now, it's off. The left, oh, the right side is... As you can see, it's beep, it's beeping on the left side. There is no current, even if I finagle it. If you turn it on, there still should be current there, obviously. And then on the left, there is current. So that's how it should be. But as you can see on the left, it doesn't work. That means that we have to replace the switch. And the whole reason that we replaced the fan was because my mom said that, I mean, among other problems, that the light wasn't easy to turn on or it didn't turn on. So instead of buying a $100 fan, what we could have done was buy a $5 switch replacement. I mean, in the end, it was kind of hard to use the fan beforehand, so I guess it's not too much of a loss, but just figuring that out now is a bit of a conundrum. My dad actually replaced the fan not knowing that the light was broken, because we've never turned that light on for like five years. Also, my mom said that apparently I broke the light by switching it on and off too much, but uh, I guess... Don't switch the light on and off, kitties, because that's, one, annoying, and two, it might break your, your switch. Who knows? <laughs> well, in my mom's defense, my dad probably should have checked the wiring beforehand. I mean, I wouldn't have checked the wiring beforehand because previously I thought it worked. Uh, and also, in my mom's defense, it wasn't exactly $100. It was more like 50 60 because we got it at a 50% discount because, you know, Lowe's was closing. But, so I guess, maybe it wasn't a total loss. Alright, moment of truth. Okay, first, oh, why don't we do them both at the same time? Three, two, one. Hey, that's beautiful. Alright. Oh yeah, th there's also the extension thingies, but I think uh, my mom has them, and it's probably a good idea, because if Bella was up here, she'd probably play and tangle herself in the thingies, so I probably don't want that yet. So, I'm Ayman, and thanks for watching. Please like, like comment, and subscribe, and look at other videos on I and Ayman, uh, both my YouTube page and my Facebook uh, Facebook page. Also, um, if you do have an issue with the Switch, like I was mentioning before, I also have a video on that, so go check it out. And uh, you will you will see Izami there. Uh, I know you, you probably didn't see him in this video, but you will see him there. So, for now, uh, signing out. <laughs> Peace.